What's up, bitches? Hello! Hello! People of YouTube, today, this is The Real Diggers, and we talk about vampires. Let's think, let's think about the plot. Because I don't know if I remember entirely, <clears throat> because it's one of those movies where you walk out of the theater, uh, and you don't remember what happened. It's like, you know, the next day you wake up and you're like, I think I saw a movie <laughs> yesterday. It might have, I think it had ghosts in it. Not a good sign. I don't know. The main character in this movie, we'll call him Man. I don't remember. Does anybody remember his name? Well, it doesn't matter. Did they ever say it doesn't matter. He looked familiar to the hotel clerk. I'm positive I've seen you here before. I'm afraid you're mistaken. Th this man is the main character who gets who gets seducted by seduced Sed seduced no, no, seduced. seducted seducted by seducted. <laughs> he gets seducted by uh, one of the vampires and she takes him home and they plow and he wakes up and there's a cut on his arm and the girl's gone and the girl's gone and it's daytime and he's like what is what happened she was drinking his blood she but not in a vampire way. They can't fly. They can't suck blood. They don't have fangs. They're out in daytime. They're out in daytime. It's well, cloudy. Kinda, it's kinda. cloudy. The lighting was off pretty much throughout the room. They're in the basement. Oh my god. <laughs> the lighting. <laughs> yeah. So much light down there. And they have like a candle or whatever. Like we're a candle around the basement. <laughs> spotlight. <laughs> then around the corner, fucking spotlight. Oh, it's ridiculous. You say the guy is the main character. At the beginning of the movie, I thought it was this couple that were going camping. I thought they were. Oh the yeah, there's this couple characters. that's in the movie, and they. There's no purpose. I mean, they're in it for filler. Sam said, and I agree. I, I, yeah, I feel Honestly, like they. Didn't why else are they in there? Filler. Because it's like, dude, this is a whole lesbian vampire thing. You're gonna get to see some titties, and it's gonna make you wait and. Yeah, that's. Uh, I feel like that's oh. not my biggest complaint with this movie. At the twist at yeah. the end, I was, oh, what happened? I was, so they're ghosts. They're vampires. Yeah. Questions so let's lay it all out. Let's lay it all out. Let's lay it all out. Hang on. Let's Questions lay it out. Okay. So at the end of the movie, the, by the way, the guy keeps coming back to the vampire house after he leaves and he comes back. But the thing is, is that he wasn't drained because there's no vampires and this is what happened. So he wakes up in his car. Hey there. Hey, and there's like a dude knocking on his window, you know, and he's like, hey, wake up, dickhead, get off of this property, I'm the real estate agent, and, it, and I'm trying to sell to rich people, get out of here, you bum. Yeah. yeah. And he's walking over to the people, and they're like, oh, it's a you know, wonderful property, a lot of acreage, but two girls were murdered in this house uh, so long ago, uh, not like that long ago, like a couple of years. <laughs> and, and my theory and the movie didn't like lay it out enough or it didn't now I don't want to say that because movies shouldn't have to lay it out for you like like you're an idiot but the movie didn't it didn't, didn't, it make didn't sense it didn't make, so it didn't make sense that's what I mean like it didn't you make, need sense. To make sense you need to make sense yeah and yeah. so like inception that's a complicated movie it makes sense though in the context of that film it makes sense that's an example this movie doesn't it it creates rules tears them down with the twist, and then you go back and you're looking back through the movie, and you're like, wait a minute, if these aren't vampires and they're ghosts, and this guy's here... How did they kill that how guy? How did the guy... And then they're early in the movie, whatever... Was it like uh, a Fight Club yeah. thing? Yeah, yeah. Like, so, uh, where, like, they, where the guy killed the, <clears throat> the dude? Like, if the guy's the killer, how did he get the other dudes back to the castle? Yeah, like, how did he seduce the, the other dudes, yeah. the, the... And obviously there is the something... or whatever, the... Drugs. There's, there's something... Uh, supernatural going on because their watches would stop. Also, yeah, oh, that was, that was oh, a thing. That's a thing. And that, that was makes a sense. thing. And it's like right sense, before though. they were and gonna like kill okay the people, for... every time the watch would stop, and huh, my watch stopped. That, that never happens. It's ghost, stupid. ghost, fuck with but electronics, then, dude. Haven't you seen Poltergeist? The TV. Nobody was like, well, how come they're fucking with the TV? They fuck with the watches because they're supernatural. That's it. Yep. They shouldn't have to explain it anymore. It's not. You're not angry because of that. You're angry because of the fact that it's in the movie. Yeah. And the movie's terrible. Yeah. <laughs> oh, 
Best part of this movie, they brought back the killer from Whirlpool. What was the dude's name? Oh, Theo. 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 I don't know his real name yeah, because I don't care. He brought it. The actor <laughs> ends up getting killed by I'm thinking, the I'm vampires. I'm thinking, honestly, we're and making the director. So, yeah. It was so satisfying. Yeah. Yes. Just like in Whirlpool, the guy is still bland as all hell. He's wearing all brown. He's wearing brown, brown again. Wearing brown blazer, <laughs> brown pants, brown <laughs> shoes. Oh, my God. Again with this bland mother. goes to now listen here I find you very attractive but this stroll is becoming rather boring hey everyone we'll be back again next week with a video on Sunday hopefully it won't be as bad as these last two movies I hope <laughs>